All right, what's going on guys? We're starting off the video in the car. I think we did this last time. So if you guys remember previously, round two, round two yeah, we went up to Moreno Valley to go look at a Torino. Didn't work out. I'll put the, no, it was a Galaxy. Yeah, it was a Galaxy, you're right. So I'll put a little screen up, a couple, you know, I'll put a couple clips up just if you, do, if you don't remember that video. Um, didn't work out. Car wasn't what we thought it was. So we're going up for round two for a different car. Nice shot. Um, and this one's really cool. You guys are gonna like this one. All I'm gonna say it's got a full roll cage, it's got a big motor. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Hopefully it's not a piece of junk. I really just don't wanna see big softball size holes in the door jam, stuff like that. Um, this one I believe has a title, which is always good. <laughs> Hopefully we'll and, see. And uh, it's another project for Chris. So he has that I rock on my channel. I'll put a couple clips of it if you don't remember that. This is this is our old friend, Mr. Krispy Kreme. <laughs> I see you guys commenting every once in a while. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Krispy Kreme, welcome back. <laughs> so this is a project for him, not me, uh, but we're gonna go up and check it out. So we got like another, probably an hour and 30 minutes left in our drive or so getting on the freeway and then we're just gonna go all the way there. Um, I believe it's up in Fontana this time. It's a little bit further. It's nice and easy. It's not in a weird spot. It's in a guy's driveway. So all we really have to do is just roll it back and it's on a flat street. We can just push it onto the trailer. But you guys are really going to like this thing. So without further ado, we're going to head on up there and check out the car. So stay tuned. I'm gonna film so if we don't film I'm just gonna end up back on the trailer but we're gonna go check it out and talk to the guy if I can film you'll see clips if not you'll see it on the trailer so I'll catch up with you guys in the next clip I like the center lines though. Yeah. The cage weld's actually pretty good. Yeah, that's what I was looking at. I like it. That actually looks pretty nice. A one and three quarter. And then the harness bar and everything. That's pretty sweet. The yeah. floors are pretty decent too. Yeah. Not bad. Not bad. It's all right. Cool stuff. That's pretty stout. Yeah, it's still a cast head. Uh, yeah, it's 2013 tags. Yeah, I was looking at the. That's kind of cool. Is that how they all come? Is that how they all come? With that trim? Let's see if it has a clutch. <laughs> what the hell? Feels weird. It's not like. Uh, you know how it gets easier and then harder? Like it's just gradual and I don't... I don't feel it. Oh yeah, there it goes. Yeah, now I feel it. The Z bar probably, huh? That is so old school. That's first, second, third, fourth. That's really cool. Yeah, everything seems to work. You break your bike. Yeah, <laughs> right? <laughs> That's why I'm just... Who's like that when I got here? Yeah, there's no brakes though. Uh, there's a little bit at the bottom, but I don't know. A heavy duty clutch. I, I had it trimmed down and specially made. So it's 3,900 pounds. So That's you're going to get a workout on your leg. I was looking at that. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to see if it was stuck or what. And I'm like, what? It's not like hard and then easy. It's just hard the whole way down. All the way down. All the way down. But it freaking hooks. Yeah.
Sweet. Sweet. is just a badass looking car. So cool. Hey, you set this up, Chris? There you go. Line him up, Sean. has like no emotional realizing. Yeah, he's literally numb. He doesn't know what to think right now. I mean, now I'm poor. <laughs> yeah, the only thing he knows right now is he's completely poor. I am poor. And we're going to a McDonald's. Straight. No, yeah, it's a turn. Sick. Yeah, but we just got done tying the car down. I'm really tired. <laughs> Yeah, we're starting. We're probably gonna go to McDonald's because we're all just as broke as Chris is right now. We just, we just want some food. We're gonna go get some food, head down, we're gonna do a full walk through the car, show you guys what we got going on. Super pumped about burnies. this. Think we'll do a burnout today? Oh yeah, we can go do it in my driveway. Yeah, sweet! I'll catch you guys there. <laughs> Alright, now I can give you guys a better walk around. It's still really windy. Nice. 
these door bars suck to get in and out. We got battery. Okay. That thing is gnarly. Look how thick that plate is. Holy crap. Dude, I was reading online. It's rated for like 500 horsepower stock. Yep. Insane. Nice. I smell fuel. Mm -hmm. Yep, you need a coil. I know. Here, wait. Yeah. Stop. Turn off. <laughs> That's weird. Why? That means the this wire wasn't making contact because you can see it arcing. Yeah. It's kind of funny. All right, now try it. It should work now. That runs good now. Suck. Here, run it without the fuel pump for a little bit and turn the choke all the way off. And just foot pedal it. Okay. Hold it at like two grand. It just die? Yeah. Yeah, so then you can turn the pump back on. Hey, what was that noise though? That, that was just backfire. Gross. <laughs> I feel like the timing's way off. Yeah, it probably is. Probably down a couple cylinders. Alright, ready? Yeah. You could have gone higher than that. All right, guys. So there you have it. This is a new project for him. Um, there's the IROC up there. That's the car that he has, if you do remember that. But this is his new baby. So now his Camaro's a parts car for this. <laughs> Basically. But yeah, we're going to have a lot of videos on this. I know you guys are... Was this? Is this an F-Body? I don't know anything about Firebirds. F-Body, yeah. So it's an F-Body. F-Body guys like this kind of stuff. Yeah, so there's a lot of videos coming with this. I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, you can always let me know what you do want to see down in the, the comments below. We have a big parts list, as you can see, on the ground right there. It's like completely filled out. we got to go through. It's pretty much A to B, A to Z with this car um, to get it running and driving safely. There's a lot of red flags I see throughout the car that we'll have safe to go through. Enough. Yeah, safe enough, um, considering there's no trunk floor and carbon monoxide sucks. So we're going to have to fix all that stuff. But let me know what you think in the comments below. Like the video and let me know uh, what you guys want to see on this car. We just do. You'll see when you edit it. Alright. But yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Follow my Instagram at one nasty eighty eight. One nasty seventy one now. Yeah, I need to change the handle. <laughs>